Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Steffi Fernandez and today we're going to be doing the first video leading up to my favorite time of the year, Halloween! <laughs> <laughs> We've even dressed our products with some cobwebs and some spiders, which I hate. I hate spiders. I wish I had one to throw it, yeah. <laughs> I don't like spiders, but anyway, let, let's crack on with the design. I've got a beautiful, bloody eyeball for you guys. Something basic and fun, perfect for your mixed manicure. Let's get cracking. So I've already buffed the nail and I'm going to go in with a color that's called toxic waste. I mean, that is already quite halloween right? You know, it gives me all these gorgeous slime vibes. You know, something that comes out of a monster. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to paint two thin layers of this color all over the nail. I mean, green, orange, purple, uh, and black, those are proper Halloween colors, aren't they? So I'm going to apply two thin coats. Okie dokie. So I've got the um, nail over here cured. I'm going to go in with my 002 uh, detailing brush and pick up some of Snow White. Now I have prepped my palette, so I've got Firecracker, Summer Sky, Series Black and Snow White and that's what, we're gonna, that's what we're gonna be using for our design today. So I'm picking up some of that Snow White and I'm starting to map out the eyeball. So I'm just gonna paint a circle, quite a large one, on the nail. And that's so gorgeous, I love this design. It really is perfect for like one of those you know, Halloween mix and match kind of manicures where you get a different spooky design on each nail. I love it. I'm gonna fill in the nail, the, sorry, the circle with the white. Perfect. I'm gonna pop this into the lamp. So we've got our white um, layer cured. I'm gonna go um, in with some sky eyes. Mm. My voice is getting funny again. I just talk too much, guys, that's why. <laughs> so I'm going to pick up some of that summer sky and paint another circle in the midsection of that um, previous circle we painted. I love this blue, it's so gorgeous. Matches my surgical gloves. <laughs> so I've done that over here. I'm happy with how it looks. I'm going to pop this into the lamp and then we'll layer another color. I'm going to add another kind of circle in the midsection of the blue circle and create another black dot. I'm just gonna paint that on top. So I'm doing that. Now what I want to be doing is kind of removing most of the color of the brush. If you can notice I'm just kind of I'm dabbing into the color but I'm spinning it away so there's less product. And I'm just going to try and outline the blue just a little bit. Can you see how very, very thin that line is? Just to add a little bit of depth. Just like that, see? And I'm going to do the same with a little bit on top of the white. However, 
it's not gonna I'm not gonna outline the whole white circle I'm just adding a little bit of kind of lines here and there just to make the eye pop out pop out slightly more and really you want to be using the tiniest pressure so we have an outline I'm now going to add a little bit of a fold on top of the eye so it looks like it's coming out of a monster because I think it looks quite <laughs> cool um, so I'm just going to do a little bit of an outline again spinning the color off the brush so I'm just going to do a little bit of a line over here looks like uh, Mike Wazowski at the moment it does Monsters doesn't Inc. it <laughs> We are doing a spookier kind of. Uh... Yeah, if Mike Wazowski had a bad day. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got this all marked up. I'm going to pop this into the lamp and then we'll go into some more detail with red. Okie dokie. So I'm going in with Firecracker, which honestly is a must in every every collection that you guys own because this red is super opaque super opaque and you can even paint with it on top of black so i'm going to again do the same thing spin off most of the color and then go to the edges of the eye that i painted and kind of just drag some lines through just like so And add some little kind of, is it veins-ish? Yeah, like bloodshot. Yeah, bloodshot eyes. eyes, yeah. Usually what I tend to have after a night out. <laughs> really the tiniest pressure, guys. So I've added those little um, veins-ish. And I'm going to just add some blood at the bottom of the eye. I think it just looks so cool, right? So I'm just going to outline, firstly, the eye slightly. And then I'm going to pick up some of the paint. And I like to have a little dot at the end of the uh, brush. Then that helps me kind of press on that dot and just pull up. And that's how you get like a bloody drop. Just have that little dot at the end of your nail, a brush, that is, if I can get my words right today. Uh, and then pull it upwards just like so. So you can have a few drops and then I sometimes just curve the lines together so it looks a bit more kind of natural, the drips. I'm gonna add a little bit more blood over here. It's Halloween guys, we need blood, right? Oh my god, I sound like a vampire. <laughs> we need blood. <laughs> I love Halloween. I'm all about Halloween, guys. This is my favorite time of the year. So I've got the blood on here. Looks insane, right? And I'm going to just add a couple more. Do you think we should add more drops at the top? Yeah. Or would you leave it like that? Nah, we could have some blood coming out. Okay, let's make some more blood. I mean, mm -hmm. yeah. It's Halloween. It's Halloween. If you can't have blood on Halloween, when can you? Well, hopefully, never, really. <laughs> it's just... Uh, do you faint when you see blood? No. No? I'm do you know people that do? Um, yeah, one of my friends is quite squeamish like that, yeah. Oh, really? I mean, I think it will make me kind of... You know what I mean? Bit, yeah. yeah. But I don't think it will kind of make me fully pass out. Actually, a fun fact, I never passed out. You've never fainted? Never fainted or anything. Well, look at you. Um, I bet I go home today and that's the first thing that's going to happen now that I've said it. Mm. Uh, but, yeah. I only have once, but it was, I was like ill, ill. Um, <laughs> oh, no. I've never just fainted randomly kind of thing. Oh, well, I hope it never happens to me. But I'm kind of curious to know how it feels. <laughs> feels Do you know yeah. what I mean? Anyway, 
I've done the uh, blood drops as well on top. I think they're super cool. They add so much to this look. I'm gonna pop this into the lamp and then we're going to top coat this for you guys. Okie dokie, nail is nicely cured. How gorgeous is this? Oh, I love it. I just love Halloween. Like you can go crazy with the nail designs, right? I mean, I don't know. I feel like I wish I lived in the US yeah, yeah, so I could too. do everyone's, uh, you know, nails <laughs> for Halloween because the, the crazy nail art over there is just insane. I mean, I wish, I wish I was there. If anyone wants me to come over, <laughs> just get me a visa, you know, I'll do your nails for free if you have a good Halloween party. <laughs> me and my partner will just watch... Um, have you heard of Spirit Halloween? Yes. The store. We'll just watch walkthroughs of people going through there and seeing all the animatronics and stuff. Yeah, it's amazing. I just... Oh, I wish they, I was... We don't do decorations like they do. I mean, no. I mean, it's crazy. It's crazy over there. But to be honest, I mean, last year, I went trick-or-treating with my sister. N not for me, of course. It was... She's young and... So yeah, fun. you were dressed up too. <laughs> and uh, I, w I just happened to be there and I just happened to also take 50% of the sweets. <laughs> <laughs> but the decoration was on point. It was in Mansfield and some of our neighbors have made such an effort. You know, they had yeah. like speakers and like um ghosts floating and graveyards and i was like good on you yeah because yeah, it was I wish covid everyone would. and not many people you know were like you know a lot of people were like oh i'm not gonna let anyone yeah, come yeah, yeah. but there was one street that really made effort and i was like good on you for the kids it was so lovely and and i enjoyed it so much <laughs> i was like yes <laughs> and this is it you guys our first halloween nail art tutorial i'm so excited I mean, if there's anything else that you'd like to see, uh, comment down below. I know a lot of people love Halloween and they want ideas desperately. So if there's anything you want me to create, comment down below and let me know uh, what you'd like to see. Also, the products for this video are listed in the description bar below. Um, as usual, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And I will see you all on the next one, hopefully another Halloween. Yeah. But it has to be another Halloween. Come on, guys. Bye, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.